And here's how to install WordPress website locally on your computer. Follow these all steps very carefully. First of all, we have to install XAMPP software in our computer to install and run WordPress locally. So go to your browser and type XAMPP download and open download XAMPP link and here you can download them for Windows computer, for Linux, and for OS X operator. So all you have to need, go ahead and install, download the XAMPP installer. Once downloaded, go to your file explorer and here you'll find the XAMPP installer. Launch the installer. Click on yes. Click on next. And here, make sure to check all of these options. Click on next. And here, select a folder or drive in which drive you want to install XAMPP. And click on next. Language, select next. Next. And here you can see the XAMPP is started to install on my computer. Click on finish. And now, click on your start menu. And here, in the search apps type here control panel and here throw the XAMPP here you'll find XAMPP control panel open the XAMPP control panel first of all and now we have to start Apache and MySQL so make sure these uh, Apache and MySQL are enabled and now we have to download WordPress file so open your browser again and type wordpress.org and you do jump into wordpress org page here click on get wordpress and now download the wordpress file once the wordpress downloaded now first of all we have to create a new database for our wordpress website so open your browser and type here localhost slash php my admin and here you will directly jump into php my admin now to create a new database for our wordpress website click on new and give here the database name and now click on create and that's it. I've successfully created a new database for my website. Okay, now go to your file explorer download folder and here you will find the WordPress zip file. Simply extract the zip file or unzip the zip file here. Now open the uh, WordPress file and here we have to copy this WordPress folder. So simply copy this wordpress folder and now go to the drive in which drive you installed xamp and open the xamp folder open hasty docs folder under hasty docs folder paste wordpress file that you just copy and now rename this folder with the name you want to make your website name so i'm giving here tutorial and that's it my website name will be tutorial and after that all you have to need go to your browser again and this time type here localhost slash the folder name and hit enter and you directly jump into wordpress installation page here select a language and click on continue and here click on let's go and here we have to add our database name here type the database name so my database name is tutorial and here username give root and password uh, leave this uh, field blank and database host select local host and click on submit and now here we can see the site title field so right here your wordpress website title and right here your wordpress website admin login admin name and create a password here 
and now confirm the password and if you want you can add here your email address and click on install wordpress and that's it i have successfully installed wordpress in my local computer now click on login enter here your admin username your password and click on login to log into your wordpress admin dashboard so here's my wordpress admin dashboard and let's view our wordpress basic site and here's my basic site once you successfully installed wordpress in your local computer now whenever you want to access your wordpress website to work or edit first of all launch the zamp control panel and enable apache and mysql then go to your browser and type localhost slash and type your website folder name and hit enter and you directly jump into your wordpress just like so and to log into your wordpress admin just go to dashboard and now you can easily edit your wordpress website locally thanks for watching